Hi guys, welcome or welcome back. Today I'll be checking out the next TXT album. This is Minnesota One Blue Hour. Um, I don't think in this album there's any like storyline relevant content. Um, just like in Minnesota Two, not obvious at least. Um, but I would like to check out the next album until I see my comments for the Star Chapter Eternity album because that's gonna be released tomorrow. Um, yeah. Just in case I miss anything and someone says anything in the comments and so I can do whatever it is before. Alright, as I said before, I'll be uh, checking out lyric videos. Again, I know lyrics aren't always correct and um, I don't really have a specific lyric channel for TXT that has very good lyrics. So if someone is very accurate for a lot of the lyrics, let me know. But yeah, I'm definitely avoiding lemmering and those channels that drop things on the first day or something or after two hours because like those lyrics aren't it. Let's go. I like how atmospheric song is. on doing like the main vocal on this part I feel like okay so the most problems I have is between Tehyeon and Hyuninkai I think I don't know for me those two sound so similar Yeonjun and Subin no problems Bomgyu depends but like these two I get mixed up all the time but I think this is Tehyeon <laughs> Oh, 
Don't jump sounds so good. I love when he drags this word. I mean, the lyrics, ghosting, uh, I didn't really think anything about the title, but like, makes sense <laughs> that it's called ghosting. <sighs> and it's so sad, like you're feeling so out of touch and alone and just like, like a ghost. I like the lyric where it's like uh, just asking into the void, something along those lines. Uh. All right. Next one is Blue Hour. Um, I have seen the music video when it first came out. Uh, I only watched this, watched it once, and I was like, "What was it last year? What year before?" No, 2021, right? So it's been a while. I don't really remember anything. I don't remember the song. Uh, I do believe I didn't really like it that much when I listened to it. So I never went back to it. But who knows? Uh, yeah. Blue Hour. <laughs> him with the blonde hair. Wow, that's beautiful. Oh. I do know. Well, I mean, obviously, since I've seen it, but like, even though I don't remember what's happening in the music video, I do remember Yeonjun. <laughs> that's just mainly because everyone was like obsessed with him. So I couldn't escape him when that dropped. Like, everyone was talking about his crop top and the pink hair and the cowboy outfit and um, uh, the mullet. So, yeah, I, 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 I know about it. Doesn't mean I'm ready. Um, yeah, okay. Ooh, the, 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 oh, what is it? Ferris wheel? That's similar to the one, the choreo in a Runaway, right? When they do the clock. Oh, God. Um, what, what is, what is this? Hi, Subin. Subin looks so good with the blue hair, but I wasn't, um, I, I Why are there three members in a crop top? If I, I don't. Oh my! Oh my! God. Wow. Why though? I guess I must have heard it because, like, that part, like, special. Okay, maybe I don't know. It's probably in some compilations, right? I think it's very. Big song of them. Yeah, I know that part. Wongi with the baby hair, I really like that hair so Yo, Jesus Christ. That's like. Oh, Neil. No. <laughs> We're gonna leave that there. Thank you very much. Okay. That's like not fair. Let's try that again. I don't have any water. Wait. Like, right from the start. Why? I do love his pink hair though. 
Baby, I know we were special. It's a kind of bonus special. No, it wasn't good. Okay, it was suspense. They're all of age, right? So I don't. I should. I... Damn, to him though. Like, what the hell? I mean, I know he works out, but still. Love the little like streaks of blue, green, yellow. But when doesn't he? Oh, his hair is so intense. I love it. Oh god, the cowboy hats. I really like, is it a star? Like the stickers on his eye. Take. I, I thought we were. Oh god. So he has. Jesus Christ. Thought it was only the other outfits that had crop tops, but. Um, Apparently not. Oh, his long ass pink Just, are we in Magic Island? Oh god. I did not pay attention <laughs> to anything really aside from where you look. Oh, it's, it's like, like... Is it Cinderella? Well, the birds bring your stuff. I think so. This part, like the dance break thing. Oh, I'm just gonna say it. It reminds me of the dance break for Dynamite BTS did for the um, MMA 2021. Maybe it's the Mamas. Where they did like the Michael Jackson dance break thing. That, that beat reminded me of that, obviously. 
I don't mean it in a bad way. I don't mean anyone copied anyone. I'm just saying it reminded me of that. And why did this go back so far? I really like to hear him with the blonde hair. Tell colors. between Subin and Taeyeon's hair in this short. I don't know, it's just so appealing. What are those? Are those birds? Reading about all that, or oh, was it like a dream? This remi reminds me of the scene from uh, a Love Song, where Yeonjun wakes up alone at the end. So, uh, as you probably saw, like some parts I could actually, I, I actually knew. I'm guessing those were part of some K-pop compilations. And that's where I heard them because I don't think I remember it from this far back. So, uh, yeah. Uh, next one is We Lost the Summer. I know the song. Um, it's one of the two TXT songs that were on my playlist before. Um, because when it dropped, it was like obviously in the middle of the pandemic. And um, I just loved all the... Um, relatable pandemic songs we got and um so i checked this this one out because i heard it was about the pandemic and i loved it so yeah um i don't know if i've seen the music video though all right let's check it out In the bathroom, summer. Oh. Ah. Ah, okay. So everything was still normal. I'm guessing they were in school and then. Oh. You couldn't see me. Look. What? Oh my god. Oh my god. I didn't see that. <laughs> oh shit. Why is he like that? I knew he was gonna look good and I, I, I've seen pictures with him in the pink hair and I kind of wanted him to come back but now like he, it, pink Yeonjun is dangerous like okay. What's up with my freaking Why doesn't it work? I don't know Cute The dog. <laughs> Why? 
What is this? Cool. Ah. Uh, no, it's not. Look at his lips. Oh my god. Honestly, he has one of the prettiest lips. He has the prettiest lips, one of the most pretty mouth. Oh. I can't English right now. And he has, oh my god, he has a ponytail as well. Are you kidding me? This is like everything I don't need. <sighs> okay. And he's cuddling, oh my god, okay. No. We're off to a great start, awesome. And the fake tattoo is like, What is up with that? Okay, can we? Oh, hello. Subin is just always cute. <laughs> but look at Bongyu. What the hell is he doing? How is? How can someone be this pretty? He has so much hair. <laughs> so fluffy and long. Cause we lost the summer. We lost the shelter. Take your child and do your job. Oh, I'm lost. Shelter. Take your child and do your job. Oh, they have stickers in their um, albums, right? It's so cute. Oh my god. The sides, the reflection being all snowy and dark.
that's that's like a save a screensaver. Ooh. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, so obviously I knew the song, I love the song, I love the message. Um But even though if you don't relate it to the pandemic, it's it could be a song about friendship or relationship. Um because it's never clearly stated in the lyrics that it's about the pandemic, the law of vaccine, but like it could be inter interpreted as another way. So I like that even though it's about the pandemic and you. I like how it's clearly about the pandemic and you can, you, you get that from reading the lyrics, but if you like. I don't know, 10 years from now, when someone uh, listens to it and doesn't really think about the pandemic, then it's just, it could be taken in another way. It's not like, oh, it's not re relevant anymore because that has been like years ago. So I really like that. Uh, all right. Next one is Wishlist. Never heard it. So I'm excited to see a new song. Uh, let's go. Oh, and I do know they have a special video. I'm sorry, I'm pausing a lot in this video. <laughs> I know they have a special video or a special clip for this, but it's a holiday version, so I'm saving that for sometime in December. And, uh, yeah. Please tell me now. on trying to say which part I think are Taehyun and Kai just because I'm so not sure about those two.
off in the back. I like this a lot. I like how it's about um, trying to figure out what to give someone for their birthday. And um, it's like, I've been on your timeline, but like, I don't really know what you want. Um, and then this part where like, you know, maybe I should just confess. I like you. <laughs> I love that. So cute. So now we're already on to the last song. Um, this is Way Home. Um, yeah. Let's check it out. I really like this photo, by the way. The sky is beautiful. Pathway I came from are all lonely and dreadful. Press harder with all your energy so that no monsters can chase us anymore. Wait, did I suppose? I didn't even realize it. Oh, he came in nice. I'm trying to figure out if, like, way home, if home is just being with the people you love, like family, friends and stuff. That's, like, 
where no monsters can hurt us anymore if we're with the people we love. I mean, it's so true. It's just like every single song I love, and I still need to get the physical album because, like, I want to get it in store because I can't afford any more shipping costs after after that one. And the other albums I got recently, but um, I need to pick that up. But um, every song on the first day's child, I absolutely love. Uh, this one, I really like the beach side tracks as well. Blue Hour, a lot more than I thought I would, because as I said, I remember not liking it as much, but I really like all the songs on that. And um, the previous albums I've done, like the the early ones, there were like a couple of songs that I liked, but majority I would say were like songs that I don't listen to in my personal time. Um, love all the co- title tracks. Um, I think there's always like one or two B side tracks on the previous albums which I like. Yeah, another album down. Um. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.